In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to perform sprint planning with Jira. Whether you're a team lead or a project manager searching for an efficient way to manage workloads and streamline your project progress, this guide will walk you through the simple steps of setting up a Scrum project in Jira and organizing your team's work using sprint planning. First, we begin by creating a Scrum project using Jira's Scrum template. This is crucial because the Scrum framework is designed to help teams work together, applying agile principles to manage complex projects. When you create a new project in Jira, select the Scrum template, which will provide the essential tools needed to support your sprint planning activities. By selecting this template, you ensure that you have the right setup for implementing sprints effectively. After setting up your Scrum project, Jira automatically generates two main tools for you, a backlog and a sprint board. These tools are central to the Scrum process. The backlog is where you collect and organize work items, often referred to as user stories, tasks, or issues that need to be tackled. It's the comprehensive list that your team will work from in future sprints. Once you have your project set up, the next step is to add your list of work items to the backlog. Consider your project's requirements and the tasks necessary to achieve your upcoming objectives. You can add each task to the backlog, ensuring they're properly described to avoid confusion later. This step is essential to establish a clear vision of the work scope for your team. After you have your backlog populated, it's time to plan your sprint by selecting the tasks you want to focus on for the upcoming sprint. This is where the flexibility of the backlog comes into play. Simply drag the selected work items from the backlog section over to the sprint portion. Here's where Jira helps make the sprint planning process intuitive and dynamic providing you with a clear visual layout of your planned work scope. Once you've determined which items will be part of the upcoming sprint, you're ready to initiate the sprint. Navigate to the top right corner of the interface and click on Run Sprint. By doing this, you formally start the sprint, making those items visible on the sprint board. The sprint board becomes your central hub for tracking progress, allowing you to easily manage and review each task's status during the sprint cycle. And there you have it. You've successfully performed sprint planning in JIRA. By following these steps, you set a solid foundation for your project's success, ensuring tasks are organized, manageable, and completion is always within reach. Using sprints, your team can minimize inefficiencies, focus on what's essential, and continue making progress steadily through agile practices.